I've never been so comfortable with someone. I felt like I knew him my whole life. When I met her, I was like, I just felt something real different. Like, I really felt like from the beginning, I just felt very comfortable, felt very relaxed. It just felt very, very natural. His sense of humor definitely is what made me just fall in love with him right from the beginning. You know, and it ended up working out really well. <laughs> story. We met through Instagram and he was brave enough to message me. I had just messaged her like we had been going back and forth with each other speaking and then one day I just messaged her and we started talking and then you know we talked for about a month before we actually ever got to see each other. First date, we went to Cheesecake Factory. You know, went in, had dinner. When we came out, she had misplaced her phone. So she had me go back into the restaurant. And at the time, we weren't dating, but I didn't want to just be like, hey, my friend dropped her phone. So I said, my girlfriend dropped her phone in here. And I'm looking for it. And we searched for like five minutes. I couldn't find it. I came back out. She went in, and she was like, yeah, my boyfriend just came in and was looking for my phone. And then when she got in the car, it fell down on the side of the chair. So she picked it up and you know, we had a good laugh about it. So it was like a good first, a good first like experience and fun story to tell for a first date. The first date, it was just, I'll never forget that first night together. And we, it was so long waited. We talked for months. I'm just so excited to spend the rest of our lives together. It's gonna be amazing. sister is the biggest blessing and that blessing needs to be protected and cared for. Ryan, you have proven to be a generous, open-hearted man. I have watched you freely and unconditionally love my little sister. It has been an honor to watch your love story unfold. It truly is a fairy tale. from the first moment we met. I loved you five years ago, I love you now, and five years from now I'll probably love you even more. So, um, very happy and very blessed that I get to be with you. Love you. May the wind be always at your back. May the sun shine warm upon your faces as it did this evening. May the light of friendship guide your paths together. May the laughter of children grace the halls of your home. May the joy of living for one another trip a smile from your lips and twinkle from your eye. And until we meet again, my friend, may God hold you in the palm of his hand. I want you to know that these are the hands of your best friend, standing in front of you today saying, I will love you for the rest of my life. These hands are protective and vibrant with love that are being held by each other as you promise this today.
this ring. With this ring. I V Web. I V Web. With this ring. I V Web. I V Web. <laughs> it is my pleasure and my honor to pronounce you husband and wife. <laughs> Ryan has been my best friend for about 27 years, and to back that statement up, when websites ask silly security questions such as, who is your best childhood friend, my answer is always Ryan. But eventually, life happens. We move out of our parents' houses, we get good jobs, and we start a family of dogs. And I'm speaking solely of Ryan here. I haven't done any of these things. <laughs> but may your life together be filled with laughter, joy, and love. Congratulations to the two of you. Thanks, buddy.